A new study from Germany suggests that persistent infection caused by chlamydia may create conditions for cancer since not only does the bacterium create mutations in host cell DNA, it also blocks the cellular functions that try to repair the damage. The findings are published in the journal Cell Host and Microbe. Chlamydia trachomitis is a bacterial infection that is the leading cause of sexually transmitted disease and infects over 90 million individuals worldwide annually. Chlamydia is often unnoticed, can persist for years with no observable symptoms, and has the potential to damage a woman's reproductive organs. This new study reveals that chlamydia can create a long-lasting change in the genome and epigenome of host cells. Such changes are increasingly found to be responsible for a development of a range of cancers. It was found that host cells that are persistently infected with chlamydia had elevated levels of different types of DNA breaks. However, not only did the investigators discover that chlamydia-infected cells have changed DNA, but their DNA response function no longer worked properly. This led to broken DNA, which was no longer repaired in those cells who did not enter a state of cell suicide. Chlamydia-infected and DNA-damaged cells that did not undergo cell suicide continued to proliferate, passing on the DNA damage to their daughter cells. The result was an increasing population of rogue host cells that have escaped the normal mechanisms that ensure that broken DNA is not replicated, a hallmark for cancer. This discovery is significant since it establishes that since an infection leads to cancer, then vaccination to prevent the infection or antibiotics to eliminate it may also prevent the cancer.